Hi everyone, this is IQ from IQ Renders here and in this video I'm going to be sharing my tips on how I get the best quality models on SketchUp 3D Warehouse. Let's go! The SketchUp 3D Warehouse is probably the world's largest 3D store for SketchUp components. It's so large, I mean, one can actually get lost in it trying to find components for various projects of your choice. I mean, there's so many components, you need tables to chairs to anything you can probably think of. If you hit it on that search bar, it surely pop up. But the major question that many people have been asking is, how do I get the best of the best quality models on 3D Warehouse? Coming to 3D Warehouse for the first time, you're greeted with, if I may say, mediocre models, maybe low quality, like due to their file size and everything. But in order to get that realistic render that you're looking for, you need high quality models. And I'm here to show you how you're going to look for those. Now, there are two ways where you can get 3D models from 3D Warehouse into your SketchUp scene. The most popular way actually is the is from the SketchUp application itself. On the toolbar, you have the Open 3D Warehouse here. If you don't see this on your SketchUp, you simply go to View, Toolbars, and you move down and you go all the way to Warehouse. You need to check this box. or how I personally use it and I feel is the most efficient method, I simply go up to Google and I simply search for my 3D warehouse. Now here are my three best methods on how I get my best quality models on 3D warehouse. Number one, tweaking the properties tab. Now in the 3D warehouse websites on the left corner right here, you see a properties tab right here and below it you have file size and polygons file size self-explanatory the size of the file required and since we're looking for a quality model we should know that the size of the file is going to be pretty large and then polygons maybe something around 7,000 or 15,000 will do so we simply tweak this by dragging the file size to around 35 and also wait before I do that let me show you this is what we had before this is what we had before so we had this couch, you know, this, you know, simply modeled. You personally can model this on your own. And as I love this side, you can just share anything you want. So simply drag this to 35, take this to about, oh, 15K. That's 15K should be all right. Oh, let's, let's go up a bit. 35, 35, yeah, let's be even. 35, 35, 36. And then boom, we have it higher or better quality, if I may say. Now we're getting to see more detailed models here, yeah? like more cloth work. I like this. More cloth work here. More beds actually. Oh, the sofas. Not that much of a change, but you know, the change is really visible. I mean, yeah, you may be searching 3D warehouse for hours, and you won't be able to find these unless you tweak these settings over here. So that was method one for this. Now on to method two, I'll simply say this is my one of my best like modes of finding the good best quality models. I simply go to collections and here in collections, there's something you need to be wary of. Um, not every <laughs> thumbnail, like a YouTube thumbnail is as it seems. I mean, this image here, this may be like from the furniture. Uh, company, but when you download the model, you just see maybe mediocre and everything. Like, for example, this bad boy here. Okay, this image looks is too real, and I'm very sure what you're going to get when you download it is something like this. Yeah, so you got to beware of those. But in collections, you have to look out again because. It's, it's like a hunt actually, it's like a hunt. So you just simply search, search, search and you stumble upon really, really cool and really, really nice model sharing. There was like, this is Technion, shout out to Technion. Uh, he has these conference tables here. They are really cool, not that detailed, but just in case you're looking for a presentation or anything, you can really give him a check. But yeah, that's it. Collections, you can just browse through and then take note of your favorite. I have a whole collection of collections actually. So it's really cool. 
and my third and final best method of getting my quality 3D models is I save the best for last actually. I save the best for last because this is a more detailed search and it will require a lot of research on your end. So wanting the best quality models, I mean, you have to either search for furniture companies or so in wherever. You just search for furniture companies and then, or let me just, let me just put in one I already know. Let's say Natsuzi. Yeah, Nazi is a really, yeah, really large furniture brand. It's the world's best known according to them and everything. So simply just go to 3D Warehouse and search Nazi. And if you're in luck, yeah, you have some of their models here. Maybe some a bit mediocre, you know, some a bit mediocre, but it's still, still something. And then this way, properties ruler comes handy you just simply drag this slider and then drag this to and then all right i don't know why we're getting big buildings here but okay maybe not see that they don't have that much models here but let's look for a more popular i think the most popular furniture brand in 3d warehouse that of almost every um, architectural visualizer i know uses bnb italia so yeah again yeah no these are really cool couple of mediocre ones here and there but again we tweak the settings take this over to 40 Let's slide this up okay bring this down a bit then 20 then magic 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 then yeah okay wow this is really cool uh-huh now you you can just see way better components here way better or you simply go to the product rollout and then yeah so that's all for my three ways of getting the best quality 3d models on three sketchup 3d warehouse do share with someone if you know this will help them and leave a like if you know this will really help you in the long run and also subscribe to this channel to stay updated on more content and follow me on my social media where you can check out my gallery to check out all my visualizations made it models i got from 3d warehouse and models i got from other mm, websites too so i'll see you all in the next one